guys welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is Nezzy if you are new here and in today's video we are going to be trying out the new makeup by Mario surreal foundation I heard a lot of good things about this foundation and I can't wait to try it I am also going to show you guys some products that she glam sent me from their glitch collection and yeah guys if you want to see how I got this look and my thoughts on this foundation and the she glam products Please continue to watch. So before we get started, I want to give a huge shout out to She Glam. Thank you, She Glam, for sending me some of these products. This is part of their Glitch Out collection, and this is what the items look like. They sent me a three um, packet of lip glosses. They also sent me a blush palette. They also sent me two eyeshadow palettes. And a lip scrub, which I unboxed already. And I'm going to put this on now. And this is supposed to be really good. You just scrub this on your lips. It's a little lip scrub. It has little, you know, it's a scrub. So you put this on your lips and you use circular motions to exfoliate. And Lord knows I need this. My lips have been so dry. And you just use circular motions. With your finger on your lips. And then rinse with water. And they should leave your lips nice and smooth. So let me do that and I'll be right back. You guys, my lips feel amazing. They feel silky. It feels like I have gloss. Not gloss, but like, you know, Vaseline on my lips. They feel really smooth. I really like this product. So I picked up the Makeup by Mario Surreal Skin Foundation. This is new. And I saw this all over TikTok. I saw this all over YouTube. And I was like, I have to try it. So I picked up the color 18W. And this was the closest shade to my skin. The ones above, the numbers above this was too red. And the numbers below this were too light for me. So I think this was a perfect match. I swatched it on the side of my face. And I asked one of the girls at Sephora did it look like a perfect match or at least close to it and she says i don't see anything so she said that's a good thing because it blended with my skin perfectly so i can't wait to try this so this is going to be look it's still sealed i have not tried it yet so i can't wait to try it and i'm just going to read off what sephora's website says about the makeup by mario surreal skin foundation it says it's a breathable luminous foundation that effortlessly builds and blends to illuminate the complexion with customizable long wearing coverage. Now I know this is a medium coverage. It is. It has a natural finish. It's hydrating, medium coverage as I said, liquid formula and long wearing. So I'm excited and I love Makeup by Mario. I think he is awesome. I think he is so talented. If you guys don't know, he's the makeup artist for the Kardashians and you know, just a very well known makeup artist. You see all his um, items at Sephora so yeah so this is what the bottle looks like so the makeup by Mario surreal skin foundation many people have said that they were a little skeptical about it because of the glittery particles that are in the bottle inside the foundation but as you may or may not know it's just to keep your face illuminated and looking flawless and again it's medium coverage so let's I'm gonna try this guys I prep my skin already I already Moisturize. I did my skincare routine this morning and it's primed. I'm going to put a few pumps on my hand. Again, I am in the color 18W and this is what it looks like. And I know a lot of people try it with a sponge or with the brush. I wanted the Makeup by Mario brush, but it's sold out in all the Sephora's around where I live at. So I might have to order it online. So in the meantime, I'm going to use my Anastasia brush. And let's see guys, I got some on my brush. I hope you guys can see. This is my perfect color. This is a perfect match. Look at that. Wow. This is a beautiful foundation. Well, it's 
Doesn't feel heavy on the skin. Look at that. Look at my luminous skin. Wow. This is really, really nice. I'm just going to do half of my face. Mm -mm -mm. Wow. Can you guys see? No foundation. Makeup by Mario Surreal Skin Foundation. I am super impressed. I am not surprised because I love all his products. I'm really not surprised. This is a beautiful foundation. Wow. Lord, and I ain't going over today. It's Sunday. Happy New Year, guys. <laughs> today is January 1st. Wow. I can't believe we're in 2023. Look at that. Wow. I put this on effortlessly. This is amazing. I don't know if the light is too bright. I hope it's not. Let me get up close. What a beautiful foundation. Okay, I'm going to finish putting the rest of this foundation on my face. And then I'm going to incorporate the She Glam Glitch Collection also so I can show you guys. But yeah, so far, I absolutely love this foundation. So now we're going to do eyeshadow. And I'm going to use one of these palettes by She Glam from the Glitch Out Collection. These are the colors. This is, um, the pink is Upload. The green is called HTML. The blue is called RAM. They're like computer names. And the um, yellow is called Circuit. And now this palette, it's like for a smoky look. The colors are Algorithm, which is this pretty silvery shadow. This is called Hard by, I'm sorry, Hard Drive. The gray one is Hard Drive. This one is called Megabyte. And the top one is called Mainframe, which is a dark black color right here. So I don't know which one I want to do. I don't want to do smoky because it's daytime. Again, I'm not going anywhere. But I think I'm going to try this, this palette. So let's just have a good time doing this. So let's see. And right away, it's, it's, it seems really pigmented. Look how much is it. I just tapped it and this is how well, I tapped it twice. I still don't know what I want to do. Okay, let's just let's just play with it. This is so pretty. Okay. I don't want to put too much, but I'm sure it's buildable. Just This is just with two taps on here. I got that color. All right, let's go in with the pink shade. The pink shade is called Upload. I'm going to use a clean brush for that one. I'm going to put that one in the center right here. That is pretty. Pink is my favorite color. So far, so good. I don't see any fallout. The color is pigmented. Really nice. All right, she go. Should we do the yellow? Let's do the yellow. Another clean brush. <laughs> I'm 
Well, the yellow seems like there's a lot of fallout, so, hmm. All right, that's weird. The pink and the blue was really, there was no, hardly no fallout, I should say. But the yellow has a lot of fallout, but, you know, let's, we're, we're, we're giving you a chance. Okay. And I love yellow. So the yellow has some fallout, not too bad though, but it has some fallout. Okay, I want to try all the colors in this, so we're going to try the last color, which is called HTML. And I'm going to put this shimmery green in my inner corners. Oh, this green is so pretty. Oh, my God. So now I'm just going to blend a little bit of... There's really no harsh lines, but I just want to blend a little bit. So I'm going to blend... Maybe I should use a clean brush. This is so cute. I'm just going to blend a little bit. Just a little, because I think there's really no harsh lines on here. So. Take the pink one and blend over here. You want to use your brush lightly. Take the brush and... Like, hold it lightly. So now, let's use the She Glam Reboot Blush Palette. This is what it looks like. This is supposed to lift up under your eyes. I saw some TikToks on this. And this is this shade right here, which is called BRB Loading. Is that what it's called? Yeah, it says BRB Loading right here. It has a sad face, a sad emoji. Well, you know, the if you can see that. I hope you can see that. And then this is a red blush. This is called Unexpected Era. And the yellow is called Big Data Moves. So I'm going to put a little bit of this on my cheeks. And I'm going to put this under my eyes to give it a brighter look under my eyes. I think they're bright enough, but we're going to try it out. I'm going to use my beauty blender for under on my eye. I'm just going to take a little bit of this. That's what it looks like. And just lightly tap it under my eye. That's bright. But hey. And I'm not going to do the other eye, just so you can see the difference. I hope you can see the difference. This eye looks more brighter than this one. It's nice. I like it. I like this. Take a little bit of this red blush right here called Unexpected Error. Just a little because, I don't know guys. Yeah. Just. Just 
just a little. That's pretty. I like it. I like it a lot. <laughs> Guys, I'm going to do lashes, and then I'll come back and do lips. So let's try on these lip glosses from the Glitch Collection. I have on MAC Cork Lip Liner. I am going to try the first one, which is called Double Click. It is a black lip gloss. It's not bad, but I don't like this lip gloss with this look. So let's try the next one. This is .com. It's green with yellow shimmery glitter inside. This is pretty. This is really pretty. Last but not least, this is Reboot. It is a pinky shade. I love pink. Pink is my favorite color. And if you look closely, guys, to the tube, it has like a swirl of pink, light pink, and white. Let's try the lip gloss on. Haha. <laughs> I love me some pink. Yes. This gloss is perfect with this look. And although I would do the green one as well with this look, this so far is my favorite. The green one is my second favorite and the black one is my third. So tell me what do you guys think? I will be back with my final review on all the products I use. Stay tuned. So my thoughts on the Makeup by Mario Surreal Skin Foundation. This right here, right here, this is going to be my holy grail for 2023 as far as foundation. This is an amazing, amazing foundation. And I'm not just saying that. I love the way my skin came out with this. It looks flawless. The makeup does not feel heavy on the skin. I did not even use a setting spray on my skin because I wanted you guys to see what my skin looked like without setting spray. I did set under my eyes with a powder because I tend to crease under my eyes. But the rest of my face, I did not even use my Sephora Micro Smooth Powder, which I always use to set my face and then I use a setting spray. I didn't use any of that. And look how my face looks. It looks flawless. This is, I'm telling you guys, if you have not got your hands on one of these foundations, run, do not walk to Sephora. This retails for $42, and it, I believe it comes in 30 or 31 shades. This is my perfect shade color. Many of the other foundations that I have, I have to mix, or it's not a perfect shade, and I have to kind of work with it. This one right here, look, perfect. Perfect. When I ran to Sephora to get this because I didn't walk, I ran. They only had two of this color left. The shelves were almost empty. I was like, wow, like, hmm. And it's all, it's trending on TikTok and on YouTube. I'm telling you guys, please take it from me. I'm not going to steal you wrong. Go get this. You will not be disappointed. You really won't. Makeup by Mario, you did your thing once again. I hope you guys enjoy the video. If you are new here, please, please think about subscribing to my channel, liking and commenting on this video. I wish you and yours a happy, safe, blessed new year. Feliz Año Nuevo. Until the next video or vlog. Adios.